my dear viewers, welcome to this reading. This reading is for all Taurus, and it's right now, Taurus. This is for you. Everything you need to know right now. It's a timeless reading. You can use it any time, and there's many of them. So it, whichever one you click on, it's going to tell you right now what you need to know. Welcome, my dear viewers. Welcome, my dear Taurus. I hope you'll enjoy this reading. Thank you all for being here, and let us begin. Let's begin with the first and most important two messages for all Taurus for right now, starting with the first one. The forgotten. This can be sometimes feeling as though you are forgotten, as though you, as though not enough people care about you. Sometimes you might be going through that. But at the same time, it is about missed opportunities. You might be feeling as though you're missing out on opportunities. Or sometimes feel a uh, fear of failure. You might be going through that. But always remember, my dear Taurus, everything is divinely, you are divinely supported and you will get what it's right in divine timing. The next one for all Taurus right now, it says the Smith. This is about overthinking things and taking action. Sometimes overthinking can be put aside where you can take action. If you are certain, you can take action. So overthinking and taking action both at the same time right now, you might be going through both of these situations. Now, let's see what else you need to know for right now. Starting with the Sacred Forest and see what they want to tell you. Two messages. Paul Taurus right now and it shows that you are maybe you are going through some sort of meditation uh, some sort of um, heightened vibration enlightenment that's for sure your um, your crown chakra is going to be uplifted and your vibrations are going to be uplifted I feel like they're preparing you for a new beginning you're going to overcome a major challenge they're preparing you for a challenge which you will overcome but also you are elevating and starting a new life so the heavens are preparing you my dear Taurus to overcome a challenge and to be on top of it and start a new fresh page the truth for all Taurus right now yes you are going to be energized without a doubt a lot of energy a lot of power fire energy you could be dealing with someone of fire energy Sagittarius Aries Leo they could be inspiring you you are getting free also they're showing you that you are free they're teaching you about freedom about a new beginning and about how to transcend to a high level this fire energy either Sagittarius Leo Aries is going to be very supportive I suggest you watch your uh, general reading for um, November for Taurus so that or for the month that you are say you are in the month of November and now you watch that month general reading so you understand who the fire energy is so it can be very clear to you now let's have a look at two important messages for every Taurus right now and we have new beginnings the full this is about freedom a new cycle comes and you are going to feel free, free from all burdens, no cares in the world, just absolute freedom. And a lot of happiness comes with freedom. Freedom because you have no worries, nothing to think about, nothing to worry about. The next one for all Taurus right now. And we've got celebrations. You are going to be celebrating an ending. You are going to be celebrating a collaboration. You could be celebrating something that's starting. You could be celebrating something magnificent. We'll find out more as to what it is that you are celebrating as we go along let's take four messages for every Taurus right now starting with the first one and the Sun shining in your path this is about love this is about radiance this is about healing this is about abundance in every area of your life this is about success to the highest level and a beautiful relationship so it doesn't get any better does it that's, that could be the reason that you're celebrating let's have a look Seven of Wands, you're taking a stand on putting your foot down and setting boundaries. And this is the boundaries you set and putting your foot down and fighting for what you believe in. You are going to win and finally you are going to be set free. Free from a lot of headaches. Wow, you have the King of Cups, somebody of water, water energy, Scorpio, Cancer or Pisces. This is someone that might be very supportive, someone that might be uh, by your side or maybe you're putting in the boundaries in regard to someone. This person could have also Earth energy, Virgo, Taurus or Capricorn. I feel like this person could be united. This person could, this person could be a, per, a person that has Earth and water energy. But you're setting boundaries and ultimately you are reaching two levels of comfort. So that is great to know. Now let's move on to the next level. There are going to be three more messages for every Taurus right now. Yes, this could be a Virgo because I keep seeing, as I'm shuffling, I'm seeing the Hermit, the truth for all Virgo right now. So, you, yes, if you have been feeling restricted and at the mercy of people and circumstances, that's why you're fighting and putting your foot down and saying, no, I will not accept this. This is too much and I will not have this. 
I want my freedom. And I think you might be winning. That's why you're celebrating. Something being done too much, control or um, codependency or something very uh, excessive. It's making you tired because it's too much. This is your healing from this and it's coming to an end. And it could be that that was restricting you, that situation. It's coming to an absolute end. And then, then we have, yes, you see that? The seven of wands. You are putting your foot down and fighting for your rights. You will not accept any more being at the mercy of others and they dictate what happens. You are going to be putting down the laws and regulations and boundaries. I will not do this. No, this will not happen this way. I want it this way. So you are going to be setting rules and regulations and it's going to work for you. So it's all great. And this could be in regard to someone that has water energy, cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Okay, one, two, three. That's it. That's beautiful. Finally, you are going to get your justice, my dear Taurus, because uh, it was the Hierophant right at the bottom. Now that we've established all this, let's see what else you need to know for right now, my dear Taurus. Right now, let's see. Right, the feather. This is about abundance. This is about easy money coming to you. Divine intervention in your life. You are gifted from the heavens. I feel like you are going to be doing light work, even air-related uh, matters, traveling, um, you, you don't have to decide. You, you've got the privilege not to decide. Because you have got the, um, the fool, it shows that you are free from a lot of restrictions. And that explains it because easy money is coming. Maybe that's what you're celebrating, the easy life, easy money. The truth for all Taurus, right, a treasure is hidden for you. Worry-free finances are coming. Money is going to be in reserve and you're going to have excess, a lot of it. Um, not access to it, excess too much money. And it says here, some of you are going to be looking at careers in executive sales, planning, hidden talent is coming to light and a treasure, hidden treasure at the same time. So that's magnificent. Let's see what else you need to know right now. We're going to take two more messages from this deck. And the first one says, glasses on, it says, um, getting to know each other. You're getting to know someone and the more you're getting to know, the more, um, your, the more you're revealing your innermost selves to each other, your bond is getting deeper and deeper. So as time is going by, the bond is getting deeper and deeper. Let's have a look at the next one for all Taurus. And it says there is deception. You've got to be very careful. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. Someone's not being honest. Honest. They are being deceptive. So you've got to be very careful. Okay, now that we established that, I want to know... Two more messages from another deck for all Taurus right now. Right now. We've got one. Maybe one more. Yes, there's the other one. Okay, so we have the squirrel. You might be dealing with someone that's frugal, maybe. Uh, the squirrel's about frugality, frugal. Uh, saving all the time, hoarding. Um, but at the same time, it is about creativity. The, the squirrel's about creativity. It's about, you know... Um, being prepared for anything. Sometimes it's about miscommunications, but it is about a challenge that you will overcome. And the letter A for Antarctica, you are transcending from this level to higher level, which the sun is going to help you overcome. Sagittarius, you might be dealing with someone that's Sagittarius or have got very strong Sagittarius within them. Something happens within 14 to 30 days. 14 to 30 days. Something big happens in your life in November, December. Remember, my dear Taurus, November, December, something very big. It says be patient. You are going to get a lot of stability coming in your life, a lot of happiness. But you need to be patient to overcome a challenge. Then, uh, yes, a change is imminent, a major change that is going to take place in November, December. Remember that. Okay, I've got the dates from November 22nd to December 22nd. It's amazing. I gave these dates to someone today. Oh, my God, I'm shocked. Wow, okay. Oh my God. And that someone was a Taurus. That's shocking. I just got a shock of my life. Okay, I gotta concentrate. Now, Taurus, right now. This is shocking, my dear viewers. Uh, Taurus, right now, what you need to know. I need one or two messages. Okay, so I've got two, which is perfect. Let's see what else you need to know. 22nd November to 22nd December. Shocking. Karmic Tazi says, I'm not happy. I'm not happy. Uh, this is to do with behaviors of people around you, situations. It's like, it says, it's playing a role in what's happening with me. And it's hard for me to see a way out. They're not, you're not happy 
where you're at, your circumstances. I'm not happy. This is to do with karma. Um, I think it's to do with karmic ties. Maybe you're tying up with people that you're not happy with. But there is a new beginning. Something new is going to happen. Right? It says, I'm trying to, fi to figure out this connection. Trying to figure out a connection. I've never experienced anything like it before. This could be to do with families connected to a third person like a child, families or starting family, a relationship that is going to be transcending and expanding. This is going to expand. There could be a child already involved. Timing three, three days, new beginning and family. So that is a possibility here. Maybe the more you get to know someone, you're going to get closer and closer. But you might be dealing, without a doubt, you're dealing with a uh, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Earth and Cancer. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Sagittarius is there. Someone Sagittarius also. They're very strong. Uh, and being patient with the Sagittarius is going to help you reach to stability. Don't forget you are going to be absolutely divinely supported with the sun granting you a lot of radiance, success and love. And you are going to be celebrating a great celebration. Something wonderful is happening. It could be happening between November 22nd and December 22nd. Remember that. Okay, my dear. Taurus, that was nearly the end. I'm just going to go through and see what the Chinese cookies want to tell you. Just one message for right now, Taurus, what they need to know right now. And there it is. Let's put our glasses on and see what does it say. And it says, tough and trying times. Tough and trying times ahead. Think long term and make decisions accordingly. Avoid negative people at all costs. But be prepared to make right decisions wow that is the end of your reading don't forget even though there is tough times you are going to be you are going to be taken care of you got the sun you got the heavens transcending your vibrations to high levels you are going to be energized and the fire energy is sagittarius someone very strong behind you my dear Taurus. someone very someone cares about you a lot and their fire energy and sagittarius they've got sagittarius in them and um you will overcome all, I feel, with everything here that I'm seeing. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. Do give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you think. Please subscribe to the channel. If you haven't, it's free to do so. It doesn't cost a thing. A few seconds of your time to go click. And uh, please um, do watch the videos all the way to the end in support of me. I wish you all the love and light and blessings and everything you do. Namaste.